hinahanap-hanap namin ng mga dive master yung yung mga lionfish and uh, may naabot kami na isang malaking coral hanggang sa huminga yung coral eh we realized that it's alive pala and it's an octopus So this octopus, it's the same species of octopus na nakita namin at na document namin sa Calaguas na when they're threatened, they will squirt ink and they will change uh, shape and the color. So after diving for 30 minutes, isa-isa naglabasan yung mga hinaharap namin ng mga lionfish. Yung unang naabutan kong lionfish, black siya eh. Tapos marami siya mga appendages at uh, pag nakita mo yung mukha niya, so nakakatakot yung itsura niya. Yung kanyang way of movement is very gentle. Don't be deceived because these gentle movements, this elegant look can be deadly. The points of their fins, eh, meron palang dalang toxin ito na can kill its predator. One by one, they were coming out as if, you know, they're, they're like a, a squadron ready to hunt. As native uh, predators dito sa bansa natin, sila yung nagkakreate ng balance. Pero sa video na ito, pinapatay ang mga lionfish. Little did we know that uh, in other continents like the Atlantic, the Caribbean, the Mexican Gulf, lalo na sa Florida, they became invasive. In the United States, a lot of people buy fish from all over the world and they're transported to the United States for aquarium. People decided they didn't want them anymore. They just dumped them into the Atlantic Ocean. By the end of about 2010, most of the Eastern Atlantic were invaded by lionfish. So they'll reproduce almost every three days. We've already seen the worst scenarios in some places because they've depleted native populations of native fish. If you don't control lionfish, the food chain on an Atlantic reef can collapse really quickly. We saw another invasive species. Ito yung tayo, mga tao. May mga nakita kami mga ropes na may mga hooks. Hirap na hirap kami no, na magtanggal ng mga ropes na nakita namin doon sa barrel coral. Alam naman po nila na santuari itong lugar na to. Kaso nga lang, hindi din siguro nila pipigilan yung gutom. Kaya kahit na alam nila na yung bawal, pinipilit pa rin po nila. Bagong bago pa ho kasi nakikita nyo naman wala, wala pang lumot, parang kagabi lang po nahulog. At bago pa kami makabalik sa Pampang, merong isang isla dito. Ang tawag nila dito yung uh, sandbar. And uh, nung napadaan kami, Nakita namin ang daming basura, so we're going to do our mini cleanup. Nagulat ako dahil halos mapuno namin yung dalawang sako ng mga basura, which uh, contained mostly single-use plastics. In the end, tayo pa rin pala 
yung may kagagawan bakit magkakaroon na extinction dito sa mundo. Dahil nga, tayo yung nag-introduce ng mga invasive species na yan. Tayo yung nagkakalat ng mga basura. Tayo rin dapat ang gumawa ng solusyon habang maaga pa 